Hello and welcome to Steel and Stone Afrikaans. We're talking about plurals and this is the second part to the lesson where we'll focus on the long vowel sounds. So the format is the same if you've watched the previous one. Here are my example sentences. Dit is my naam. And the new word here is naam which is the Afrikaans word for name. So the first sentence is this is my name. The second sentence is jij het baie name. You have many names. So now we're focusing on words like this, nam, which has a long vowel sound, and what the plural of that word is, name. So let's look at some example words using long vowel sounds and what their plurals are. I'll do the English one first. The Afrikaans word for name is nam. The plural names is name. The Afrikaans word for leg is Bien. The plural legs in Afrikaans is biene. The Afrikaans word for crown is kruen. Kruen. The plural crowns is kruena. Kruena. The word for wall is mir. Mir. So you see there are some new vowel sounds in Afrikaans that you don't find in English. Sounds like e, mir. The plural walls in Afrikaans is mira. The word for door is dir. Dir. Slightly different than the word in the word the sound in bien. Pay attention to the difference. Bien, dear. This one is slightly more closed mouth, if I can say it like that. The plural doors in Afrikaans is dira. So hopefully you start to see the pattern, what happens to the words with long vowel sounds. The word for color is clear. Clear. The plural colors is clearer. Clearer. The word for muscle is spear. Spear. The plural muscles is spira. Spira. The word for tiger is tear. Tear. The plural tigers is tira. Tira. So I'll say the Afrikaans words again with their plurals and try and focus on this, the vowel sounds as well as uh, trying to get used to the, the new words uh, to expand our vocabulary. Nam. Nama. Bien. Biena. Kruen, Kruena, Mir, Mira, Dir, Dira, Clear, Clear, Spear, Spira, Tir, Tira. So if you've watched the previous lesson, the second half is going to be similar where we have our example sentences and in blue here we have the English singular and plural forms and I want to pick uh, the singular version and the Afrikaans word that corresponds to this. So the sentence is Dit is my so I'm looking for the Afrikaans word for name 
which is nom. Dit is my nom. The next one is jij het baie. I'm looking for the Afrikaans word for names, which is name. Jij het baie name. So, <coughs> I'll read the first one and pause so you can see if you can get the word and pronounce it hopefully close to correct. And then I'll repeat the, the sentence. So let's do that. Dit is my bien. Dit is my bien. Jij het baie Biene. Jij het baie biene. So maybe the sentences don't make uh, that much sense sometimes, but we stick to the same sentence structures and the same words, only cycle through the, the, the new words to practice them and their plural forms. Let's do the next one. Dit is my kruen. Dit is my kruen. Jij het baie kruene. Jij het baie kruene. Dit is my muur. Dit is my muur. Jij het baie muur. Jij het baie mire. Dit is my dier. Dit is my dier. Jij het baie dier. Jij het baie dier. Dit is my kleer. Dit is my kleer. Jij het baie kleren. Jij het baie kleren. Dit is mij spier. Dit is mij spier. Jij het baie spieren. Jij het baie spieren. Dit is my tier. Dit is my tier. Jij het baie tieren. Jij het baie tieren. So that wraps up our, the second part of our lesson on plurals covering long vowel sounds. We have two more to go where we'll look at some exceptions and words ending on G. Until then.